Glory to God. I want to celebrate everyone that is joining us this morning. God bless you. This is Daily Devotion with Jesus. And I'm super excited because Daily Devotion with Jesus will be exactly one year on the 1st of August. And we have good news coming. We have good news coming. Good news coming. So we're going to be staying posted to our community so that you'll be able to get some of the information. We are rolling out on or before the 1st of August. So you'll be staying very glued to our social media pages to get all the information that are needed god bless you but for today god wants to speak to us powerfully from his word father will bless you we worship you we give you praise let your name be glorified in the name of jesus as we look into your word transform our lives and help us to walk in the victory that you have ordained for us in jesus name we pray amen a sweet book of the book of galatians chapter 5 verse 1 this morning Galatians chapter 5 verse 1 is says, Stand therefore in the liberty wherewith Christ has made us free, and be not entangled again with the yoke of bondage. This scripture is just simply telling us that we were once entangled in the yoke of bondage, in the yoke of sin, in the yoke of destruction. We were heading straight to hell. But Jesus Christ came and brought victory for us. He came to deliver us from the bondage, from the yoke, from the entanglement we had with the devil. But now he's telling us to stand therefore in that liberty. We should stand at the place of liberty. We should stand at the place of freedom. We should stand at the place of that freedom he has obtained for us by shedding his blood on the cross of Calvary for us. That is where he wants us to stand. We are not fighting any battle. He's the one fighting the battle for us. We only have to involve him by standing in the place of victory, declaring who we are in Christ. We are free in Christ. And he also cautionedly spoke to us here. He said we should not be entangled again with the yoke of bondage. That yoke of bondage where we were delivered from, that chains of bondage, those depression and affliction and sin and habits, he's only cautioning us here that we should not be entangled again in that such act. Remember, if we stand at this point of victory, everything is possible for us in Christ Jesus. If we stand at this point of victory, everything is obtained for us without struggle, without any stress. If we can understand our place in Christ and our place in the victory, a lot will be going well with us. Therefore, you must renew your mind today and stand in the place of liberty, in the place of your freedom, which Christ, our Lord Jesus, has obtained for us. And it shall be well with you, well with your businesses, well with your finances, well with your academics, well with everything you do in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for your word, bringing out light, bringing out transformation, even for our lives. Let your name be glorified in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. Have a great week. Celebrate your Monday and enjoy the rest of this week. But remember, daily devotion will be one year, exactly one year on the 1st of August. And we have good news coming your way. So stay tuned. God bless you. Peace out.